This morning, 29 million Americans woke up to more blistering temperatures as the summer heat wave continues. NBC's Priscilla Thompson is in Houston, Texas with a look at that. An astonishing milestone this week. Monday and Tuesday, the hottest days ever recorded on Earth. Here in the U.S., Americans feeling the brutal summer heat firsthand. Over 20 million under heat alerts today. It's really hot, really humid. Central Florida reaching a triple digit heat index Wednesday. It's too hot. I want to move out of Florida. My body's not made for this type of weather. Local emergency managers putting extreme weather plans in place. Just last year, we activated the plan twice, and it was only for a couple days. It's now been active for over a week. Connecticut's governor also activating statewide extreme weather protocols to protect residents from brutal temperatures. Sarasota, El Paso, and Portland all seeing record highs Wednesday. And in Tucson, Arizona, it was a staggering 107 degrees. Summer's only just begun. Always parks that have sprinklers. We carry a lot of water. We spray them down all day. <laughs> But the sweltering heat is already in full force. Drinking a lot of Gatorade, water, staying hydrated. And temps still spiking with that global record. Even with half the world in winter, the average global temperature at 62.6 degrees Monday, and even higher, 62.9 on Tuesday. Climate experts warning this is not a milestone to celebrate. We're pushing our ecosystems and our climate into a different place uh, than it's been for the entirety of human civilization. And that is alarming. All as Americans are bracing for more historically hot days ahead this summer.